sitting home, it starts to get unhealthy, perhaps, and, and I think she should have regulated the activity uh, a little bit more. And Elaine, tell me what we know about how the guns were stored, and also tell me, if you can, about this suggestion that he was trying to emulate and indeed compete with and beat other mass shooters, including Anders Breivik, who killed 77 people in Norway. Yes, well, a Hartford Current reporters, Dave Altamore and Ed Mahoney, today reported that uh, investigators did find uh, news articles that talked about the massacre in Norway. Um, it's, it's a theory they're looking at that perhaps he did emulate um, the, the, the Norway shooter. Uh, it's just a theory at this point. It's just something they're looking into. But finding uh, those news articles in the home is uh, something that is definitely part of their investigation. And in terms of where uh, his mother kept the weapons, what do we know about that? Uh, well, you know, we talked to, uh, one of the things about Nancy Lanza is she didn't let too many people into her home. It was something that we heard uh, very often from people that uh, she just kept people sort of at arm's length toward, toward the end there. And uh, from what we did hear from um, people that had been in the home, they weren't too sure of where they were stored. Uh, we did hear uh, through earlier reports that uh, they were possibly uh, in the basement. Um, but as to how they were kept and whether or not they were locked up, um, we, have been able, we have not been able to actually uh, get that concrete just yet. I think 